Welcome guys, it is the Axeman here and we are back with some more Paleo Pines, yeah boy, and today we're going to get that Staracosaurus. We found the most beautiful Staracosaurus ever, it's pink, it's blue, and we kind of befriended it, but it had the wrong food, uh, it needs something else, which we did get a quest after we did that to talk to Pippin. So I'm going to guess Pippin's going to give us um, some food to tame it, and we need to do it before the day ends, because if the day ends... I believe the creatures are all going to swap out, like all the colors change and stuff. And we don't want that. So, yeah, we're going to jump into it. We're going to talk to Pippin. But before we do, if you enjoy the episode, make sure you whack in a like, you subscribe, and you ring the bell. Enable uh, the notifications, follow in the social medias, and let me know if you want to see some more of this game because I am having a lot of fun. And if you want to wishlist this and, you know, get ready for it on Steam, it'll be in the description for you. All right, let's jump into it and talk to Pippin then. You look like someone who needs a poppin. Poppin, anyone? All right, let's chat to you. The poppins are particularly crunchy today. Can I tempt you? Uh, not exactly. What do you mean, not exactly? Is there something wrong with my poppins? What could be better? Another flavor? 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 The recipe of the poppin has been in my family for generations. To change the recipe would be a laugh in the face of tradition and family values. Colin, hey, Colin, don't you think my poppins taste great exactly the way they are? <laughs> Honestly? Not really, no. Thanks, thanks, Colin. I love him. <laughs> Fine. Can't believe I'm saying this, but what do you think would be better? Juicy? Juicy. I know you're new here, and I don't mean to be rude, but that's a terrible idea. In fact, I'll prove it. You find me some strawberries or carrots, and I'll whip up a batch of juicy poppins. Okay. Uh, nothing with you. Well, that's probably for the best. Uh, okay, popping anyone. All right, so... I'm gonna need... Bring a strawberry or carrot. Do I have... I don't have a strawberry or a carrot. Can I buy a carrot? Because otherwise I'm going to have to grow one. Do you have any carrots? Mm, do you have any strawberries? Are we going to run into an issue here? Do you have any? Crap. Oh, no. No. Because we're going to have to grow our own strawberry. Is there like a reward for a strawberry? Rhubarb turnip. Oh, no. I'm. We've got to hope and pray that that guy stays. Nowhere sells them, right? You've got to have a mission for me. Oh, no. This ain't good. This ain't good unless we can find a carrot or a strawberry somewhere. Definitely don't have one, right? Clovers. Bull sacks. Bull sacks, bull sacks. Um, what if I just give you one later? How about that? Uh, or do you... Oh, no, you don't even have stuff to buy. Hmm. Okay, well, I guess... We're still going to get a Staracosaurus. Uh, it just might not be the one that I wanted. Maybe there'll be one even prettier. So what we'll do then... Uh, I guess we have to go home. And we have to sleep until the carrots have grown. I guess what we can do, I can talk to, uh, I forget what her name is, Mara down here. Maybe she'll tell us about the big crystal thing we're going to need. Oh, look at, oh, I need, also, I've not pet your Deinonychus yet. I need to pet this guy. What's it called? Does he have a name? Oh, yeah, Paprika. Oh, man, that thing's called. Can I use my journal on you? Um, nope. All right, that's cool. All right, what are you saying then? Uh, hey, stranger, nice to see you again. Golly, I still can't believe it. A real-life parasaur living right around the corner. She's beautiful. What did you say her name was? It's Lucky. Lucky? Well, I reckon I'm lucky to have met you. You know, no one's seen a parasaur in this neck of the woods in a raptor's age. And I should know. I've been to the tree line of the Dapwood and all the way to the edge of the Aracotta Canyon. Uh, they've not gone. I've seen tracks, scuff marks, and other unmentionable evidence uh, if you catch my drift. They're just... What's the word? elusive but hey who knows maybe lucky will bring him out of hiding until then i'm gonna go give all my love to this one what's lucky's favorite food um carrots <laughs> strawberries um i don't like mushrooms or tomatoes i don't know if i like beetroot but i'm gonna go for beetroot beetroot seriously whose favorite food is beetroot i've got some beetroot around here but i only took them to be polite um if I spidey parasaur tracks, you'll be the first to know. In the meantime, don't be a stranger. And um, I need to know what to do with a dreamstone. Uh, 
I don't know how that's going to work. All right. Um, are you two both follow me? Yep. Oh, look at Dom. Let's take let's take them home. So can you can come see your new home then. You've not seen it yet. Maybe we get a mission when we're back at home to get the Dreamstone and find out what that's all about. Maybe I have to like uncover one or something. It's not like one around here, is there? Also, do we have a map? No. I didn't know if we had a map of this area. Because it looks like we could break some of them trees over there to extend this place. All right. So you, you guys could both come in here, right? Yeah, you can. Okay, so to do my flute. Okay, so we want wait here, right? Or see you later. Should we do see you later? Um, Sweet. Are you see it later? Okay, here we go. Friend call, see you later. Okay, so you're just going to chill around here, right? Sort of. You will be following me, though. Hopefully. Let's just chuck some more stuff into you. Perfect. So I can't do anything with this, right? Large Valley sleeping patch. Hmm. Oh, you want pets? My bad. Here you go, Lucky. It's okay. There we go. Have your pets. Perfect. Okay, what we should do is... I'm actually going to break some of this stuff. Oh, actually, wait, wait, wait. Can I put a saddle on on my galley? Look here, he has a saddle. Yeah, but the galley doesn't. I don't really know how this works. All right, I'll tell you what. We're going to ride you. We're going to break some stuff until your stem goes down. You know, clear this area up a little, make it look a little nicer. Like so. God, you lose so much stamina by doing that. Take some of this. Level four. Nice. Take some of that. Let's get this one out of the way with. And then what we're going to do, we'll be able to sleep. The carrots might start growing. We'll check if the Star Axorus stays there. Because we interacted with it, maybe. Aw. It cries. <laughs> no. No. Okay. Uh, so you go back in here. Can we sleep? Because it's only midday. It's only the afternoon. What are you doing? Can I pet you? There we go. Have a little pet. I would like to put a saddle on you, but I'm not really sure how we're meant to do that yet. All right, boom. Let's save it. Keep playing. Go to sleep. Start a new day. All right, cool. So it looks like you can sleep whenever you want, which is always a nice thing. If I want to sleep in the middle of the day, I will sleep in the middle of the day. Here he comes. You're going to tell me about a giant dreamstone? Because that'd be grand. Oh, there's things on the ground. Where did these come from? Were they here the other day? All right. Oh, they've still not grown. All right, I need to water these. Huh. Do we just get random... Oh, there's a crystal. Huh. Am I meant to get to that? Are there crystals everywhere? Okay, well, maybe that's how we find them. All right, let's speak to Owen. Uh, good morning. Sorry to show up unannounced. I was hoping to update my data on the parasol, and as you can imagine, it's rather sketchy. Or is it the parasophoroli? <laughs> I don't know the pluration. I've never met one, never mind two. Anyway, I've noticed you've acquired a new friend, a Gallimimus, and uh, you've barely been here a week. It took me months to get Bongo to follow me home. Now, I don't mean to brag, but I'm kind of an expert here on galleys. In fact, I've got volumes of information on dinosaur care, some observed, some theoretical, and some exploited all, but all useful. Is there anything you might uh, be vexing, vexing you with the regard of a galley uh, care? Or Dino Happiness. Dreamstones, yes. I know that Lucky's pen already has a Dreamstone. Dreamstones are the most crucial elements of Dino's comfort. Science can't explain why they love them so much, but they most certainly do. If you haven't got one, you may wake up one morning and find they've run off to find one themselves. Speaking of which, keep your eye o eyes open. Dreamstones are rare in the wild, but if you're bringing home new friends, you'll need them. Okay... Uh, all right, I don't really care for anything else. I can work that all out myself. Uh, what I hate fan is uh, finger blah, 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 blah. I have one favor to ask, or perhaps you can accept it as a recommendation. Anything you learn from any species at all, can you please log it in your journal? Your journal is a vessel to house nudes, discoveries, learn preferences, traits, flavors, and much more. Use it often. You'll never forget anything. Plus, I may want to compare notes now and then. Uh, I see you've made some notes about Gallimimus already. Most diligent. Let's take a closer look at Toucan. Approach Gallimimus with your journal in hand. Yes, boss. All right. The heart is how much two can trust you. Uh, the circle around it shows how happy they are right now. The happier the dino is, the more they trust each day. Now, if you excuse me, I've got a big day planned. Destination, my library. All right, Owen. See you in a bit. Sweet. So, we can just find... Do you know, use the fruit to get Tukun's attention. Oh, he's going to play around with you for a hot sec. All right. 
Lead token to a pen. Can you share the same pen as Lucky, though? Uh, we're about to find out. Use a flute to ask Lucky to stay in the pen. Oh, this is your home. Oh. There we go. Lucky is happy to get a new home. Sweet. So can I place a saddle on you now? Place a large dreamstone in the pen. I don't have a large dreamstone. <laughs> can I place this on you now? Uh, perhaps this will come in useful later. All right. I don't actually have... I have this one. So what I need, I need to go and find one then. All right. Lucky, come on. Let's see if we can go and break this down. There's none others around here, right? So there's that one there. Can I break this? No, I can't break that. Huh. So I guess we've just got to go out and explore and find one. That's cool. All right, let's head out then. Let's see if our Starachosaurus is there. I am going to be so sad if it's not. Oh, please, please, please. Is this a dreamstone? Because this looks very stoner. Maybe. Okay, so use... Not what I'm looking for. There's none around here. Hmm... I think my boy's gone. I think he's gone. Oh, man. Well, that's a big rip. This looks like stone as well. Like, can I do something with this? Hmm. Oh, okay. Well, it looks like we can't get a Staracosaurus until we get the uh, carrots grown up. And yeah, it looks like the dinos do change every day. So if there's a dino you see, like the colours and the pattern you like, you, you need to take it. Uh, I am generally disappointed. I was I hope there's a way to maybe keep them in the future. Like if there's one that you see but you're not quite ready, maybe there's some like because I've interacted with it with it, it stays or I don't know. Something like that would have been great. Alright, let's uh explore here. See if we can find us a stone. I'm not sure if I'm gonna have to break some of it or it's it's just gonna be there, like waiting for us. Oh, is this one? See, I see these everywhere. But we can't do anything with them. Unless you need a dino to break them and that's how we get them. Hmm. It did say that the galley would go out on his own and get it, though. Uh, can we grab these mushrooms? Because that looks like... I don't know. There's a whole patch of mushrooms here. Okay. I thought we might be able to grab them. <laughs> All right. Stone, 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 stone. There's one. How do I get around to that, though? I'm not going to be able to get to that. Because there's a big log in the way. I can't get to any of these stones. Oh, I found some more Staracosauruses. Down by the river. It's my beautiful one down here. Oh, hey, look, there's another stone. Hidden behind some rocks. That a Staracosaurus has to break. <laughs> um. Also, are these a new flower? Oh, I need, need a journal before I can pick it up. Tamar Bloom. Cool. Well, definitely collect them because I'm sure some diners diners going to like them. <gasps> Is this one? Here we go. Oh, that's a small one. It said I needed a large one. Well, we did find one, though. I'm not sure how we're going to get a large one. But we found one. So they, they do just knock about, like, in the wilds. I've just found some new dinos. Okay. I did know, not know there were stegos in this. Uh, we came up here. I didn't realize I'd not come up here. Yo. So they're the Oreo Titans, whatever they're called. There's a pack of Cephalosauruses. Oh, we can't get to them though. But we can look, look at the stego. Oh my God, the stego is beautiful. Oh, look at that little pink packy. Bro, I can't wait to just play with all these dinos. Oh, this stego has spots on him. Oh, the stegos have different designs. Oh, look at him. Oh, did you just try and hit me with your tail? That's not very nice, sir. God, these things are cute, man. And then these are the, uh... Yeah. God, you're a really nice color. Oh, bro, I hope that they, like, keep adding more dinos to this game like adding new parts of the map to explore new dinos oh, yo what is this 
Hello? Are you a raptor? Wow, you're a nice colour. Okay, and then... Oh, here's the Yankee. What is this? What is that? I have no idea what that one is. I've never seen that dinosaur in my life. Oh, my dicks. Okay, right. The Yankee is now my favourite dino in this mod. In this game, sorry. Oh, my days. That is... Oh, my God. That's so cute. I don't know what these are. They're like weird alligator dinosaurs. Wow. These Yankees are gorgeous, man. Oh, I can't wait to get some of them. Oh, these berries. Uh, journal. Cranberries. Okay. I was hoping for strawberries or something. Pick them up. Can I not pick them up? Oh, not enough room in my inventory. Oh, shit. Titties. Oh, well, I guess we don't need cranberries right now. Oh, my God. Them Yankees are adorable. They're so cute. Oh, I hope we find, like, a pink and blue one of them at some point. Okay, so this little spot at the back here, I don't know if this is where all these dinos are going to be on the fuller release, but it seems like, for the demo at least, like the additional dinos that probably aren't part of the story are kind of just put back down here. Because there's like a whole bunch of them. Oh, them stegos are cool. So yeah, just behind whatever house this was. So that was Owen's house just there. I can't actually get up to that one. That's blocked off for us right now. Let me follow this pathway. I never followed this pathway, I don't think. Oh, no, that goes up to that way. Okay, I I thought I explored the whole map, but uh, apparently not. That damn. That's cool, man. Oh, I want an Anki so bad. I want an Anki more than I want um, a Staracosaurus now. All right, so what are these? Have we recorded these? We have. These are clovers. Uh, what is this? Cooking pot. Oh, okay, no, I've seen that in the trailer. You can cook food. I'm guessing we can't do that right now. All right, so, I mean, obviously we're a bit disappointed that we didn't get me Starachosaurus and it's vanished, but, you know, it is what it is. Uh, it's part, kind of what makes the game exciting, that every day could have a new creature, a new rare creature. You've got to explore and find them. So I guess that is actually kind of really cool. Um, all right, so what did we need to do? So we need to clear a boulder. Can't do that just yet. Talk to Granny... Ag me at home in Dapwood. Can't do that yet. We're growing the carrots right now. Find a large dreamstone. I think we're going to have to break some rocks to do that, honestly. Hmm. I'm going to... Hmm. Should we place the small one? See what happens. Like, I don't have a large one. <laughs> I don't even know where we get a large one. When's ever placed a small one? Right. You stay here, Lucky. All right, so if I go into here, I can place this. There you go, there's a little one. Hmm. It just really wants me to place a large one, doesn't it? I, I, don't, I don't have a large one, I'm afraid. Uh, all right, so I should be able to put some of this in storage. Um, so I guess... You know what I should do? I should probably grow all these carrots and all these leeks. Let's pop up some of this away that I don't need right now. All right, so let's make a bit more of a garden. Uh, Lucky, you're in the way now. And then we can place some carrots in here. We'll just grow all carrots. I ain't going to grow them leeks right now. We'll do them after. So it's been one day and them carrots look like that. Can we harvest them? I never actually checked. I'm, I'm going to guess not. I'm going to guess it takes a few days. Hmm. I can... Wait. Can I harvest these then? No. Do I harvest with this? Nope, that just destroyed it. Cool, just destroyed one of my carrots. Amazing. Not what I intended to do. And I didn't get any back from that. All right, yeah, so I don't know. It, there was a journal there and I was like, oh, maybe that means I can harvest it. Lucky, where did you go? How did you get over there? All right, we'll continue digging up some of this until you get exhausted, which is you are already. All right, so what we're going to do again, I'm going to sleep and we'll see if them carrots have grown. Because I just, I want to, I want us to get as, uh, 
I wanted to get that Staracosaurus, man. So bad. Are they grown? Do them carrots look like they've grown? Uh, probably one more day, right? All right. Can't, still can't get a Dreamstone. All right, so we'll quickly water these. I was going to say we can go check what dinosaurs are knocking about, but I, I I can't tame them. Oh, we have like another pretty Staracosaurus now. Look at that one. Okay, you're adorable. Little zoomy head. I kind of want to see what other dinos we have, like, back up this way, was it? Yeah. All right, well, we're still looking for a dream, a, a large dream shard or whatever it's called. So we're going to take a, a little walk up to where the Stegos and Ankies were. I just want to see if there's any new variants of them. I'd like to see some more colorful creatures. Was it back up this way? Yeah, yo, look at this guy. He's orange now. Wow, you're cool, man. All right, where's my Ankies? Oh my god, there's a bright orange Anki. Yeah, these croc dudes are weird. But these Ankies are beautiful. Look at my guy. Okay, that's the most beautiful thing ever. Oh, oh, I want him so bad. I want seven of them. I just want to live with all seven of them. They're so freaking cute. Oh, man. Can we see anything over that way? <laughs> Trying to see if we can see any of the dinos that are hiding in the background. Uh, no, I can't. All right. Dream sh Is that a tiny dream shard thing? Hmm. Right, let's go and see these guys. I think you actually had quite a... Uh, whoa. It's pinky purple. You're so cute. I want that one. His head's stuck in a tree now. All right, what about Stegos? Stegos look the same. I know one had dots on it last time. And... Oh, we've got two pink uh, Pachycephalosauruses. Nice. I love that they're different every day. I actually prefer... I know we lost our Star Axorus and I was bummed out, but no, I, I kind of like it. I'll take it back. I like it now. All right. I'm actually going to head into the town. I'm going to see if there's anyone telling us stuff on how to get a big giant dream thing. Oh, and you ain't got no missions on your head, have you? No. I mean, these two do have missions for me. Maybe I should uh, speak to them and see what they want. Maybe they'll give us something like that. So I'm a little distracted. It's my uncle's budding day and I'm completely forgot uh, until a few minutes ago. Do you have any dandelion or clover? There's nothing Uncle Taz loves more. I actually do. Fif I don't have 15 of each. But if you find the flowers soon, come back. We'll work some of it out. I have like a few clovers. But yeah, I definitely don't have 15. All uh, right, Mr. Marlow. Uh, between you and me, it's getting a bit rough with the path of Dapperwood blocked. I'm doing my best to keep up with the needs of the community, but it's tricky without my tools back home. My makeshift tool, stone tools are really starting to wear out. Um, hey, with all that clearing out you've been doing on the ranch, would you be able to get 10 stone? Okay, so I need 10 stone for you. How much stone do I have? Do I not have 10 stone? I have three. Okay. So we've got two additional uh, missions. Now, do these change every day? Uh, five flower... I think so. It's almost sell a bet. Uh, I need details on the ventral, epiral, passing of wild consoles. If you can help me get one to stay still. Okay, goddamn. Do they, they, then people ask a lot. Hello, what do you want? I forgot if my head wasn't attached. All right, whatever. All right, well, I guess we'll start cleaning up, get some stone, um, waste the day away. Uh, you know how it is. All right, so if I break these... Two stone. I needed like ten. Do I get stone from you as well? I just get wood. I need just the stony ones. Uh, there's some stony ones over there. Well, uh, you might get a level up from the next one, right? Two more stone. Actually, you even gonna be able to break another one? Probably not. How about these? Oh, yeah, we can. Ah, just not level up. Um, all right, that's actually all the tools we need. The makeshift tool. All right, well, I guess we'll go and uh, <laughs> finish that mission and then probably sleep, grab them carrots, because I'm pretty sure they're going to grow by the next day. All right, Mr. Marlow, I have your stones here. Um, yes, I did. Here's 10 stones. Thank you so much. New tools will really help out around here. I really owe you one, which reminds me, take these. Uh, it's stock I easily replenish thanks to your help. What did we get? I missed what we got. What was it? Damn, 15 wood rope. Well, bro, I need a gate now. Did you do that so I came in to buy a gate? Give me a gate. What was this again? Uh, small trough. You know what? I need one of them. I need a gate. 
And moment of truth. They look like they have grown to me. All right, so we're going to... How do we grab these? Oh, there we go. Boom. Carrots. You have to... Okay, so you've got to click it and then click it again. Like, you click it to look at them. No, don't. I just clicked it once. I was holding it before. I think that's why. And then once it didn't grow because it didn't grow on properly. Cool. So we got 14 carrots, which means we can do um, old lady's mission. And we can... Water. There we go. We can do the old... No, water, water this one. We can do the old lady's mission and then we can uh, get the juicy poppins. We can get a star axe for us. And it's a new day, so there might be a new one there. All right, let's just finish this up real quick and then uh, we'll go and have a look. All right, let's see what we've got. Um, Just the two of them. I mean, you're kind of a cool color. Nice cool pattern. Uh, okay, so looks like there's none actually there. Maybe we'll find some more by the river. Oh, you're a nice color though. God damn. God, I just want them all. I just want all these creatures like, as soon as I see them, I'm like, no, I want them right now. All right, let's go talk to Pippin, get some poppins. Then we can speak to old lady. Maybe after I get me Star Axosaurus. <laughs> I just want him first. Um, all right, popping in one. Chat, welcome back. I hope you've exited the crazy idea about poppins. Uh, bought you something. Oh, I didn't think you were serious. Okay, fine. I don't like it, but I'll do it just for you, of course. Between us, this is going to offset the tooth rattling crunchies that are the foundation of any good dessert. Here's one batch of uh, juicy poppins. I swear if my grandpappy could see what I've done to the family recipe, I don't want to think about it. To be honest, uh, to be totally honest with you, though, I've been making poppins the traditional way for years. As much as I hate the new flavor, the flavor, kind of enjoy mixing things up a little. So if you, if you're, so they're your thing, then I could put a special order on request. Anything else I can do for you? So you do you make new ones now? Ah, okay. So now we have a couple of juicy ones. Let's see. Hey, you're new. Have I spoke to you? I uh, just need a moment of your time. And then walks away. Awesome. <laughs> I think what we'll do is we'll just grab this one. I kind of like any any one of these, honestly. Uh, let's have you. Hey, you over there. Come to me. One of yours. There we go. So they all do the same thing, right? So it's one big one. And a little one. Oh, yeah. You like it? I, I don't know, I kind of like his way of, like, taming kind of thing. It's really cool. So, we can't befriend it yet. We need to soothe him a little. So, it's in the green. So, I can befriend you. Give you one of these. Let's see if this works. Maybe. Oh, maybe. Wait. Did that not work? Do you have to keep going? Uh, maybe give him a clover. I thought that means they were, they were just going to be friends you straight away. God, these things are trickier than I thought. There's a clover. Maybe another clover? Uh, I kind of want to give you a beetroot, but then I kind of don't. So do I have to have it in the middle green? Or is it just, um, if it's in the lighter green, there's like a chance it can become your friend? Okay, so now we try and befriend you. So I think this one likes juicy stuff. Like the moist, juicy things. That's why it likes clovers. The Star Exorcist trusts you. That's good. We like that. Trust me. Maybe we can pet you now? Yeah, it says I can pet. There we go. Hey, we got one. Okay, this one's going to be called Sally. Sally the Star Exorcist. Hey, oh my god, look at that. That's amazing. Hey, look, they're all happy that we've got a Staracosaurus. Oh, he's so cute. Um, what? Are you kidding me? You actually managed to befriend a Staracosaurus. Do my eyes deceive me? It's magnificent. The nose horn has got at least two hands long. All three at least. And the paradigal skamoskal is filled is beautiful. I'll say, I've never seen one up close before. It's amazing, isn't it? Oh man, it's so cool. Yeah, it makes me want to go straight to my library. What I was going to say, doesn't it make you want to go out into the field and see more? I love how they're just the complete opposite of each other, but they're friends. No time for that. I've learned so much in just these few moments. I need to head home and write this down. Though the more I look, the more there is to see. I know what you mean. Wouldn't it be cool to see different colour Staracosaurus up close? Uh, yeah, imagine a, a pink and blue one. That'd be amazing. 
That would be ideal. Uh, you guys, uh, I'll head home and write down the details we learned already. Uh, you don't have to tell me twice. Hang with Star Axos all day sounds perfect. Excellent. Enjoy exploring with your new friend. I hope you enjoy the ranch. Hell yeah, boys. Look at that thing. Oh, I want to saddle. I want to saddle for you. I want to ride you. Oh, let's get the journal out. Let's write stuff about you. Sally. There we go. Styracosaurus. So if I click onto you. There we go. That's the second dino. So it's a uh, tiller. It's the smasher. That's what we need. Herb 4. Favorite treats. A juicy. Minimal area 25. Friend call. It's a herd. So Styracosaurus or horned herb is often found grazing in the fields like its ceratopsian relatives such as the Triceratops and Centrosaurus. The Styracosaurus is a friendly rock smasher and farm tiller. They are playful and loyal and can't resist a juicy treat such as a strawberry or a tomato. All right. Uh, so I need you to follow me. So if I do that, I want you to follow me. Boom. All right. Uh, I'm also going to pick this clover up just here. So we finally got one. We finally got one. So you're just going to follow me home? Oh my god, I love it. Look, he's leveled up. Good job, looker. Oh, and we're going to have to make him a little home, aren't we? But then I need... Uh... Right, let's make him a home real quick. <laughs> and then we'll then we'll wrap the uh, episode up. I don't actually have enough ropes to make it a home. So um, I guess that's what we've got so far until we get some more things. But there is Sally. A little... Uh, what are they called? Saracosaurus. Ah. Oh. It is very cute, man. Oh, she's adorable. Oh, man. I, I Can I just pet you all the time? Can I give you a treat? You like juicy stuff, right? Uh, are you juicy? You are kind of juicy. Do you want a carrot? Eat a carrot. Amazing. Uh, Sally really liked that carrot. God, this thing's gorgeous. Sally, I love you so much. I want to be friends forever. All right, we're going to have to wrap it up and call it a day there um because we've been recording for ages so uh finally got our starachosaurus which means once we get a saddle and we figure out these um enclosures we can start breaking some rocks and stuff but uh yeah if you did enjoy the episode make sure you do whack a like make sure you subscribe you ring the bell and every notifications follow all the social medias and all that stuff thank you for hanging out i'll catch you all in a bit see you later